Hello my web viewers, in this video I'm gonna show you how to set this controller, this is the F300 uh, using the EPS-XE um, PS1 emulator, ok? Let's turn it on, ok, now let's enable the Bluetooth in my Windows PC. ok connected now let's execute the emulator if you want to download this emulator uh, i will leave the link on video description so you can click on it to download it ok let's go when you run your emulator for the first time this window probably will appear okay let's config this is the 2.0.0 version uh, HLE okay uh, this error may appear but don't worry about it okay click OK OK again OK again OK again ok again ok again uh, here leave the first option EPSXC GPU core 2.0 ok 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 next ok 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 Okay, now let's click on controller one. Okay, uh, this is the default settings. Now click on the key you want to change and press the key you want here in the in the controller. Okay, one. Let's press uh, here is the B up okay left okay down okay right okay uh, Q it's the L3 down Okay, two here, one here, square uh, will be my Y, okay, circle will be my B, X will be my A and square will be my x confusing now okay r3 okay uh, okay if the design of the controller is not like this one you can choose uh, the design here okay ok let's click ok next done ok if the wizard guard doesn't appear you can go to config uh, gamepads port 1 and pad 1 ok the window will appear normally ok now let's run again to check if it is working ok let's run a game here what game do we run Eric's Adventure Digimon Crash Bandicoot Crash Bandicoot
Sony Computer Entertainment America presents a Universal Interactive Studios production. A game created and developed by Naughty Dog. I think it's all working. I think. Okay. Okay, buddies, that's it. It's all working. Okay, thumbs up if you like this video, and till the next one.